fiery, guys. Uh, <laughs> let's just find out. Man, the sun is shining so freaking bright today. I feel like any fire elemental is really going to tap into that solar energy, honestly. Like, it's strong today. It's, it's powerful. Like, how we tap into the moon, we also tap into the sun, you know? And the solar cycles are also important. Important. Um, you know, just like our rotation around the sun, you know? So it's like... Let's see. Let's see how this sun is shining in your life today, little fiery guys. All right, hold on. I already see the message, so I just want to get started. Um, <laughs> so we have the hermit. We have um, Virgo energy here. But throw away any astrological notion with that. We could also say that you are really taking time for deep introspection, right? Like I said with that solar energy, look, this person is just basking in the sun. And it looks like in a state of like prayer or like meditation, trying to really get that deeper introspection right um and then with eight of wands i see you working towards something you're like really moving at you know a really rapid rate i feel like you're manifesting um your reality right now you're like this is the reality i want to live in and i'm going to be there <laughs> so it's like you're you're manifesting at a rapid rate um i like this <laughs> what are you doing, Sagittarius? Uh, you're being great. You're bringing greatness into your life. You're just like, you're choosing. Like, even look at how heavy that solar energy is here, too. I feel like you're really connected to the sun. Uh, and then the Queen of Swords shows up. And she's like the fucking best right and like basically you're in this no bullshit energy look at this no bullshit energy just so driven just so motivated you're like i ain't gonna be distracted me and my crows we got some business to do okay like i see that i see very like um like you've got purpose here and you're just very driven and you're gonna cut out any nonsense that tries to distract you from it I love the heavy solar energy in this. Yeah, Ten of Pentacles, bro. You're going to have it all. You're like, you're just striving for greatness. You're not settling for less. And that's what you're getting, right? Like, you're getting your abundance, your prosperity, the five of swords in reverse, no more conflict in your life, no more conflict in your mind. It's like you are dead set on the path to greatness, like nothing's going to stop you. You have no obstacles in your way, right? Ten of wands in reversing, you have persevered so much, you are not stuck in that rat race anymore. You're, you've transcended cycles here, and you've just chosen to be better at all costs yeah three of swords in reverse <clears throat> it's like you've you've had heartbreak you've had disappointment you've had these shitty ass cycles yeah you've had to overcome so fucking much but it's like saying this is the end of all that nonsense you are coming into greatness right now because you cut that shit off you're <laughs> like i'm just not doing that shit no more right you cut that shit off Knight of Wands, I see this energy ah, <laughs> of movement, motivation. Look at that fiery energy, bro. It's like, I see, look, with these fireworks, that's like celebration, something to celebrate. Something like your, your total liberation, bro. It's like, look at that wild horse. He is on fire, <laughs> okay, guys? Like, that's... That's you, dude, just free to do and celebrate. Um, 
what you're meant to do <laughs> and celebrate. Like, you just... You know you're driven on this divine path. You've got something deeper going on. You just ain't got time for nonsense. Like, I love that. Yeah, the Hierophant in reverse. So you're transcending people who just don't fucking learn or grow, right? It's the very opposite of the Queen of Swords. This is the person coming in being that antagonist, you know? And it's like, they just don't learn or grow. And you're just kind of, like, over it. You're just kind of over shit that holds you back. Your life is going to just be so much better without that energy in it. Yeah, the Wheel of Fortune. <laughs> Good fortune! Fortune favors the bold, and because you boldly and fiercely pursue a better life, that's exactly what you're going to get. That's exactly what you're going to get. You're manifesting it, bro. You're bringing in greatness by shutting out any bullshit, any toxicity, any nonsense. When you shut that out, you only leave room for greatness, abundance, prosperity. You got this. <laughs> namaste i love you guys this is such a good everyone's been having good fucking reads today i'm like damn like do you guys even need me <laughs> let me throw some oracles on here <laughs> yeah you guys need my energy don't lie <laughs> okay or at least you want to like sit here and watch them right I could at least sit here and be your cheerleader and be like, bro, you're doing amazing, <laughs> right? Because it's like, I feel like almost every time with you guys, like, there's like no drama. You're like, if they try, you're just like, goodbye. <laughs> like, Sagittarius is like a really solid fucking sign from what I've noticed. Yeah, the gift, you're very divinely gifted. Stepping away from situations that don't serve you. <laughs> it's basically saying the same shit. It's like, and also, you're getting gifted for walking away. You know? You will see the prosperity and abundance through this process. You have to let go of the bad to make room for the, what's right. You know? And to your wheel of fortune and your cause for celebration... I say, no mistake. <laughs> um, yeah, dude, I wish you well. I'll catch you on the next one, guys.